Hello guys and welcome to another quick MyDMX 2.0 tutorial, this time looking once again at the color matrix effect. While in the software you have loads of different options for different patterns that you can apply across your fixtures, if you really did want to, you could import your own video files and play them back within MyDMX. To go ahead and do that, open up the scene builder, create a new color matrix effect, and if you scroll across you'll see a small icon that kind of looks like an open image icon. Click on that and it'll open a pop-up window and you can select a video file that you can then load up and play back in MyDMX. In terms of the resolution and format, I've been using QuickTime MOV files to play back, but I believe it also works with AVI files. And also I've been taking my footage into After Effects or Premiere and then exporting it at a lower resolution. And the reason for this is because the output pixel map is so low resolution, you don't need really high res 1080p video files. Also, if you get really complex clips with lots of different animation going on, sometimes it can be really unclear and just look like a load of strobing colors. Often you'll find the simpler clips are the most effective. So that's just a quick look at how you can create your own custom pixel mapping video content. If you want to find out more information about how to use more of the color matrix effects and anything else about my DMX 2.0, go check out the playlist link down in the description below to watch all of my other tutorial videos. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments down below. And as always, thanks for watching.